Tucked away in Old Bridge is Heirloom Kitchen. It's a restaurant and cooking school where you can learn from a James Beard nominated Top Chef contestant. My mother and I opened up Heirloom Kitchen about five plus years ago. We started out doing cooking classes. We hosted a lot of pop-up dinners in our kitchen. Short rib salad I got right here. And that's how I met Chef David Vienna, who's now our executive chef and partner. This is a chicken riette. So basically it's a chicken mousse. Think chicken salad, but a little bit more refined. I love to cook fresh. I love to play with sort of Americana themes and tomes and be playful. We've kind of become known for our duck dish. Our duck is the only dish on the menu that hasn't left. We just change it seasonally with what accompanies it. So the duck is the dish that you guys have become famous for and you've perfected it. <laughs> yes. So we have a beautiful duck breast that we get from a Long Island farm and we're gonna season generously with salt. And I heard something interesting, you don't use pepper when you season. I don't like pepper unless I want to taste pepper. Like we have a beautiful cacio pepe, but not everything gets pepper. Needs it. No. Yeah. We're gonna let the skin render on a dry pan. Ah. The number one thing is people have called it hibachi 2.0. All that skin rendered out, so it's like a nice, perfect little piece of bacon. In our kitchen, but the chefs never have their backs to you, so you get to see all the food literally being cooked right in front of you. We have a homemade mole. Mm. It's got about 60 different ingredients. There's this like intimacy and rapport that you have with our team that you don't find in most restaurants. We're gonna torch the cheese Stand a little back, bit. everybody. Now that is cool. It's been quite a year for you. James Beard nomination, top chef. Yeah, a lot's happened, and uh, it says a lot of the footprint we've made here in Oldbridge. It's almost overwhelming. What a spread we have. <laughs> <laughs> it looks amazing. Delicious, and the duck is perfectly tender. Everything was delicious. Now, before we leave, chef, any spoilers for the Top Chef finale? I mean, never spoilers, <laughs> but I can say that I'm, I'm a sous chef on the finale, so helping one of the contestants try to get that title of Top Chef finale. Right. Well, stay tuned, Chef yeah. David.